I'm going to have to sh ask Sean Bormet if this story's right, but Adam Kuhn is like an aerospace, like wanted to be an astronaut or something, got too big, he wouldn't, they wouldn't be able to put him in an astronaut. The guy's like a genius, smart. Colton Show, both these guys are world medalist in Greco-Roman. Schultz wrestled this year in the NCAAs, which really helped Arizona State, but probably didn't help him with this Greco-Roman training. blowing up about that last match and folks your coach has got to know both sides got to know we have to be better than that that can't happen we'll see who gets to go on top here first because it's coming Referee's showing a lot of pointing blue. He asked for blue. It's confirmation, so Schultz will go on top first. Oh my goodness, this is tight. Wow. Should be three to one, yep. Schultz, so it's already a better match for him. Zeke Jones, Mark Perry, neither one of these guys are Greco specialists, but neither is Sean Bormet. So. This is gonna be an interesting match because Schultz has the lead. Kuhn will probably get his choice, will get his chance on top next period because it's just so hard to score on these guys that there'll be the passivity point it's really going to come down to whether Schultz can defend again if he can he's got a good chance to win the match three one at the break Colton Schultz Zeke Jones, Mark Perry in the red corner, Sean Bormet, Kellen Russell, I think, in the blue corner. Kind of hard to see around Adam Kuhn. I'm seeing a lot of masks being worn as chin straps this weekend, and I don't blame him. I'm trying to I realize how much I read lips when I'm talking to people. You want your guys to hear you, your your women to hear you. And on top of that, Texas has opened up. Schultz has got a chance to make a world, or Olympic team, excuse me, as a college freshman. He's got a long way to go to do it, but he's at least in the seat to do it. Schultz can go forward enough. They might even warn Kuhn again, which is what he really wants. Get another chance on top. Two, 
Coons got the, oh, wow, that was too easy. So now Coons winning. Schultz has got to let go. So they each got a two and they each got a one right now, so it's 3-3, but Coon wins on last point. Zeke Jones is jumping up and down with the touchdown signal to bring him back up. So it's three to one, or three to three, excuse me. Kuhn winning because of the last point. So now the clock is Kuhn's front. Kuhn's in a position where he's not literally trying to do anything, he's just pushing, but he doesn't need to do anything. to a minute 10. Forty five seconds here. Schultz has a goal to move. This is the time to go get it. Thirty seconds. The strength of your RTC is so important in the recruiting process, too. Zeke Jones, Mark Perry, Lee Pritz, Frank Molinaro, Arizona, Sean Bournemette, Kellen Russell, Sergey Bella Glazov, Josh Torella, Michigan. It's not going to happen for Schultz. Coon's going to hold on. A lot of respect between those two guys. I think I love what's going on here, by the way, folks. They're not, they haven't raised these, these athletes' hands all the time. They're now putting gloves on so they can raise their hand, which that's the photo. That's the photo you live your whole life for. When I was wrestling, that's the dream I had, to have my hand raised to try to make an Olympic team or as an Olympic champion. That's the one we all dream of. 